today on Hong Kong Blu-rays we're taking a little look at David Chang film Shaolin Mantis recently released on Blu-ray by 88 Films <laughs> And I'm Leon. So, this release from 88 Films stars one of your favourites, David Chang. David Chang, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, quite an interesting, quite different story in this one. I haven't watched this one for a long time and I've, I've completely forgotten the story to be honest. Right. Uh, but yeah, it's very interesting. It's a different setup to normal, isn't it? Because he's not your tip atypical hero. No, no. So, in this one, David Chang is commissioned by the Emperor to infiltrate Tian Mansion and get a list of rebels from Tian, mm -hmm. the Elder, who is played by Lao Kuo Wing. And, uh, yeah, it's, it, he's got some dubious morals in it, maybe, I think. Yeah, I couldn't, couldn't fathom it out, yeah. to be honest. Kind of leaves it open-ended for you, doesn't it? Um, so anyway, he gets sent on this mission. Mm -hmm. And when he gets to Tim Mansion, he's first hired as a teacher for yes. the granddaughter, yeah. played by Cecilia Wong. Mm -hmm. And we haven't really seen a lot of her before, but no. she was very good in this, I thought. She was good, yeah. And uh, he ends up marrying her, but that's because otherwise the Tian elder was going to have him killed. So mm -hmm. if he marries her and stays within the mansion basically for the rest of his life, then he's okay. But the double-sided blade stat is if he doesn't get back with the list to his uh, to the emperor, then eventually his parents going to get executed. So mm -hmm. he's in a yeah. predicament, and I thought that put a, a subtly different framework on the traditional kung fu movie. Mm -hmm. how, how did you feel about that? Yeah, I thought it was well a difficult choice. Mm -hmm. I think, and um, you know, you could see a sort of um, turmoil his character uh, you know knowing he has to get back to his home so that he could you know he had to get back with the list so he could get his parents released mm -hmm. make sure they were safe but also he knew he was in a tricky situation to try and be able to leave Tian Manor yeah you know because he had to have this information and he knew where it was yeah and um what, what was the granddaughter called again? What was her name? Gigi. Gigi. What did you think of the actress playing her mum? So we've got Lily Lai in there. Mm. I'm not convinced that she's old enough to be a mum. Probably not. No. <laughs> but um, I liked her in this as well. Yeah. You know, we've got um, a, ni a nice cast in this one. Right at the beginning, we have mm. a cameo from Gordon Liu and Lee yes. Hoi Sang. Yes. A, we both having a bit of a fight scene with um, David Chang. Mm -hmm. And then, then you get a bit of story and less come through after mm. that for a while. But there's a lot come the end, isn't there? And I was quite surprised at the content. I mean, I shouldn't be. It's a Carl Young film. Yeah. So you know you're going to get solid kung fu. Yeah. But I'm used to David Chang in more swordplay or basher fu, as we call it. But this, there's techniques, there's weapons. There's a lot of weapons. There's tons of weapons. Three sectional staff. Yes. Big fan, three sectional staff, and David used that's great. Did you like the weapon work and some of the spear yeah, work and stuff? Yeah, yeah, I thought it was all really, really clever. Like you say, he had this massive um, shield as well, didn't he? I mm -hmm. like the use of that. Um, yeah, the, the staff, I think um, David also had some sort of daggers, didn't he, that he was yeah. fighting with at one point? Yeah, some, some daggers, there's some butterfly knives, there's there's a whole host of weapons in mm. this and, and the spear like you say that was really good as well really yeah. clever and being able to take there's quite a lot of that of like when with the spear and it's yeah. just going straight past the camera and mm. i thought the timing on that was really good and it really dynamically filmed mm. it like feels like it's coming at you and um we we were really impressed with his suit in this one as well weren't we yeah you know that he wears at the end when he, when he turns up to go back into tn mansion for all the fights at the end after he's trained up which we liked the training too, didn't we? Actually, watching the mantis, the praying mantis. Yeah, that was really clever. And he kind of like made it yeah. out himself by copying its movements. I wonder how they did that with uh, the actual insects. Yeah, yeah, it was very good. And um, yeah, so when he turns up in that suit, mm. 
uh, we were like, oh, I love that suit. The way he's rocking that felt. It was uh, very cool. It felt, yeah, it felt on par to me with Bruce Lee in his yellow tracksuit in Game of Death. Yeah, yeah. And then Baby Chung in that. I don't know if that's accidental or not. I mean, who knows? Because the, the, the final sequence of the film is going through different rooms, room to room to room, whereas mm. Game of Death, Bruce Lee's going floor to floor to floor. And Baby Chang's doing a similar sort of thing in this. So there's, yeah. you know, yeah. somebody had pointed that out to me on Reddit and said, mm. oh, it's like, okay, man, I thought he's, he's bang on. Yeah. 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 And, you know, when you look at it, it does have those similarities. I, I, I really enjoyed it. I thought it was, it did have one long, slow bit if that was my own, you know, only criticism. And then it's Kung Fu heavy at the end. Yeah. But the fights were really well structured and really all part of the story. And, None of them were over long. There was a lot, but it didn't. You didn't feel that any of it was over long, like we've seen in some other films. No, no, it, it seemed to fit better. Like um, recently, we watched obviously World of Drunk Master, and that just felt too much. But mm. this, it mm. felt right. Mm. You know, I, I, I enjoyed it. Like you said, it helped mm. tell the story a little bit more. Yeah, definitely. And I've been looking forward to it for quite a long time now. After discovering the Mantis style. Yeah, and, more um, too. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, it was good. Great. I liked it. So shall we? Um, Give all scores for the film now? Yeah. yeah okay, for me, guys, it's a 7.5 out of 10. For me, it's an 8 out of 10. Great. And a little look at this package. We have a nice slipcase, mm -hmm. don't we, with fantastic Kung Fu Bob artwork. We're, you know, like everybody else, we love his artwork. That's found absolutely fantastic. And we also have the slip cover on a DVD case, which has the reversible, more original artwork too. So you get the best of both worlds. And then we have some lobby cards in there, don't we? Which yes, are really, really good. Do, yeah. I like the lobby cards. Um, you know, it's always nice to have these collectibles. And we also have a poster, which is double-sided, old and new image. And on the disc itself, we have um, a little sort of video essay by David West, which is quite interesting. That guy yeah. really knows his stuff. And then we got two fantastic audio commentaries, one by Frank Jeng and the others by our two mates, Arnav and Mike Leader, doing their usual. So, you know, th those are always entertaining. Mm -hmm. And there's a, a, a nice, like, 20 plus minute interview with John Chang, which, yeah. Yeah. you know, I really like. You know, I really like that guy. He's done a lot of different films throughout time. Uh, it's a really good package and some trailers in there, including one for it as Deadly Mantis, which is a more fitting title, really, because there's nothing to do yeah, with in this. Shouting. But yeah, for the package, um, I think we're going to rate this one four stars. Yep. It's a seriously good package. So, any last words before we go, Shaz? Um, no, I think we've covered everything. Well, that's it from us, guys. We enjoyed this one. Um, if you haven't got this film, we'll put some purchase links in. Hope you enjoyed this quick look at um, Shaolin Mantis with David Chang. It's a lot of fun. We will um, catch you guys next time, hopefully. Remember, be true and buy the blue.